Thank God. I'm starting to think I'm Thanks for calling Sundial Loans. Please select from the following 26 options. For our opening hours, press 1. Oh, your brain's out. To press 2. To find out how to spell Sundial, press 2. About repayments on an existing Sundial loan, press 3. Yes, 3. 3. Can I... Do I have to You're going to make me press it? You're going to make me press it. 3. Thank you. To contact us about repayments on an existing Sundial loan, please download the Sundial oh app. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Download the Sundial, Sundial app, you automated bitch! God, I hate you! Stop! Brand new pants. Are you kidding me? God damn it, man. Stain resistant. Yeah. Yeah, clearly. If you have a pen, I can give you my number. I don't have, I didn't have a pen anyway. I didn't have a pen anyway. Jeez. Sorry. What the hell are you doing in here? Oh my god. Oh, no, 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 no. Get out now before I call the police. Oh god. What did you eat, dude? No, 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 no. No. Not again. Not this time. Out. Now. Definitely not these. These are my favorite. God bless America. What's good, Bimmer? Come on, man, seriously. What? Dude, we own the store. So that literally means we can do anything we want up in here. No, dude, the bank owns the store, okay? Sundial owns the store. And it says please. Well, I mean, if you really want to get technical about it. I'm pretty sure the bank's going to get technical about it when we default on our loan next week. By the way, you left the door unlocked overnight, again. So that sharding homeless guy passed out in our store last night, again. Did he take anything? What are you looking for, man? Of course he didn't take any money. There's no money to take, because nobody shops here, Gavin. Ah, right, well, that's a relief. Dude, I cannot believe I let you convince me to buy this store with you. 
Hey man, don't blame me for the fact that sometimes you make decisions with your other head. What other head? Dude, your dick head. Come on, man. You were stuck at that crappy sausage factory supply center, and you thought that if you owned a place like this, you might actually get laid more, like, at least one time. Are you serious? That's ridiculous, dude. That's not why I quit my job. I would never act so irresponsibly. Hey, bro, it's okay. I did it for the same reasons. Look, no worries, all right? Trust me. Business will pick up, man. Yeah, yeah, whatever, man. Hey, I need those sundial files. Are they in the back with the tax records or what? Uh, which files? I don't know, the repayment schedule or whatever they sent us when we took out the loan. Oh, yeah, definitely. Probably. Maybe. Let me look back here. You know what? I actually think I might have taken them home. Taken them home? Dude, you can barely take yourself home. Why would you take them home? I remember the day we got them in the mail. You said, I'm just gonna file these away. So where did you file them away? Look, here, this is it, right here. Okay, so I just need to figure out how we... Wait, $2,000? We took out a loan of $20,000 from Sundial. Yeah, no, uh, that was the Sundial loan. Right Plus Loans was doing a deal for anything under 20K, so I took out 18,000 with them and two Gs with Sundial. Why two Gs with Sundial? Uh, because that was the least amount you could have taken out with him? Duh. Fantastic, man. How about you? All right, man, this will help your dad out, all right? So yeah, dude, this no problem. Chester, what the hell? Dude, <laughs> What a badass, man. That wasn't cool. Oh, I'm sorry, man. How uncool of me to interrupt you dealing drugs to a minor. How'd you know that kid was a minor? How do I know he wasn't? Because it's you, Chester. I told you not to hang out here anymore, man. Well, I like it here, man. It's a, not a bad little spot, you know? I got my secretary, Bell South, here, all is well. Why do you need, don't you have a cell phone? Yeah. I got my cell phone right here. Listen, man, you have to go, all right? Why? It doesn't bother Gavin. Well, it bothers me, all right? You're scaring away customers. <laughs> yeah. Listen, it's obvious that I'm actually bringing more traffic to your business. I get more customers than you. Yeah, I know you do. You need to work on your marketing. All right, come here. Take a step out here. All right. Your storefront. Looks like you're selling mobile phones from the 1980s, man. And this sign, I mean, what is that? Is that, is that Bloom Bold? Yeah, it is, actually. Yeah. You're really good with fonts. Yeah, I know. I used to be a graphic designer. Oh, I like the lady. She's sexy. You know, she's leaning on her hand there. I want to know what she's looking at. I'm curious. But then you scroll on over to this fat-looking Donald Trump character just sitting on his ass. Oh, that does look like Donald Trump, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. It looks like he's waiting for somebody to bring him a milkshake or something. It was, yeah, it was supposed to be like a, like an everyman kind of silhouette character. I don't know, man. Oh, OK. All right. I mean, in the name, intimate apparel. I mean, that's, that's pretty obvious, don't you think? Yeah, that's what it is. I don't want people to be confused. Gotta know what you're getting. It's, it's, it's undies. Oh, all right. Alex, listen to me. Do you want to know why people come to me? Because you sell them drugs that they're addicted to? Oh, no, man. Because I give them what they need. Drugs. No, Alex. You want to know why I'm the most successful shaman this side of Duplin County? Adaptability. I have what it takes to adapt to my customers' needs. They get the shakes, they need a doctor, I'm their doctor. Uh, you're not a doctor. That's not what I said, Alex. I'm an entrepreneur, just like you. You got to just find out what your customers need, and then sell them that. Yeah, well, maybe I can't adapt to my customers' needs, Chester, because I don't have any customers. Stop rubbing my face in it and take your business elsewhere, all right? Please, Chester. Time for a break. A break? You just got here. <laughs> a 
relax, bro. Let's get some coffee. You wound up way too tight. Yeah, yeah, caffeine will help. And this time, I'll lock it. All right. All right, what do you want? Huh? Cappuccino, Americano? Well, I've already ordered two regular coffees. What do you mean you already ordered? Coffee shop app, bro. Don't gotta wait in line, <laughs> don't gotta tip. Jeez, Louise. Does it also drink the coffee for you? Is there an app for that? Is there an app for that? <laughs> what are we gonna do about this, man? Look at this. Everyone just uses the internet to shop nowadays. Oh, shit. Dude, check it out. What? That chick is totally watching porn. Well, she's not, dude. She's like shopping for dudes' clothes. That's exactly what I'm talking about, dude. You're so immature, man. You have, you have the attention span of a, of a gnat. A what? A gnat. You know the small Eastern European bird? Oh, a gnat. A gnat, yes. Whatever, dude. That is no fashion website. I know porn, and trust me, my friend, that is porn. That's not porn, dude. We need a serious oh, plan. Oh, shit, dude. That's an escort website. <laughs> She's ordering an escort. I didn't have to go to a website. I could have helped her out. I'm right here. Gavin, shut up. Shut your mouth. Shut your mouth. I need you to be more responsible. I'm so responsible. You're not responsible, dude. You showed up late this morning with food. None for me, by the way. Thank you. You leave early all the time. I stayed later than you yesterday. Yeah, and then you left the door unlocked again last night. Wait, who's in our store right now? Gavin, who is in our store right now? Two salty mocha frappa kappa fappa whatever for Mr. Big Boss 420. I, nah, that's not, that's not me. <laughs> I bet it's not. You know, people hide behind their usernames all the time. I just don't get it. I'm not, I'm not Mr. Big Boss. It's an online order, man. You're here. It's yeah. Big Balls, you know. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, are you? Big balls. I'm not, I'm not, why would you want big balls? I don't know, man, it's just Mr. Big Balls. I gotta go, okay, have a good one. You too. I have, it's like regular it's okay. sized it's just, balls. No, just own it, just own it. Gavin, where are the right plus papers? Um, they should be in the back. Well, show me. Uh, I'm busy, dude. Busy. Hey, Alex, Gavin. Dang. What's up, man? Chaiwala. Anyway. Hey, can I hang out here for a few minutes? I gotta clean up on aisle 10. What's on aisle 10? Uh, adult diapers and diarrhea medicine. Yeah, whoever left that mess was having a bad day. And I got new shoes, so they don't pay me enough for that. Uh, since when does your dad start paying you to work at his store? Since he knocked $200 off the rent. Uh, your sister told me he pays her eight bucks an hour, plus he doesn't charge her to live at home. <laughs> yeah, all right. <laughs> no. Why would Papa do me like that? Mr. Gupta's OG. Yeah, maybe it's because you spend all your time beating your meat. Technically, I'm the butcher, so it's my job to beat the meat. Does that mean I beat my dad's meat, too? On the other hand, your sister actually does her job. Yeah, she does. She acts like she wants to work at Gupta Grocery the rest of her life. <laughs> she developed this app where she can detect spills and everything on the floor, even when she isn't on the floor. And you can make you know, grocery orders from your phone, like, <laughs> stupid. It's nothing new, dude. 
Gavin, can we please talk about the... Yes. Got one. Good afternoon, madam. Can I uh, help you find anything? Okay. That's, that's fine. Enjoy it. Have a nice day. All right. I'm tired of this. Dev out. Gavin, over here. <sighs> You've lost the loan paperwork, haven't you? Well, not exactly. Not exactly. Well, then what exactly? I didn't necessarily take out the loan with Right Plus. So who did you? Howdy, partners. Um, have you seen a young lady about yay high? Uh, smells like banana candy. You can't smoke in here, dude. OK. Who did you take out a loan with? Well. Who? Gavin. No, 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 this is not, this is not real. This is, this is not happening to me. You took out a loan with, with Chester the drug dealer. Okay, relax, Alex, it's gonna be okay. It's only partly financed by me. The other half is a, a phoner. Falker? Falker. Mother Falker? Mm-hmm. So, it's gonna be uh, 20K from me and uh, 20K from Falker. What? That's $40,000! Hey, math. All right, let me break it down for you. I had to borrow 20K from Falker first, and then um, I, he charges interest. He charges interest? He charges $20,000 interest on $20,000? Yeah, it's based off the uh, current federal student loan rates. Oh, oh my god. I think I'm, I think I'm having a hug. I think I'm going now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Contact us about repayments on an existing Sundial Howdy, link. partners. You develop this app. Find out what your customers need. Coffee shop app, bro. Oh, Timber. There he goes. Alex, is that you? Why did you go into business with Gavin? Were you thinking with your dickhead? Are you okay, dude? Breathe. Ride it out, buddy. <sighs> yeah, he's okay. I, I gotta go. I gotta go. <gasps> Whoa. Whoa. Good save. Safety meeting? Sure. All right. Oh, ew. Mm -hmm. Hey, Mimi, uh, I actually need your help with something. I okay. have this big idea. You're, you're tech savvy, right? Yeah. OK, I need some help. OK, I have my computer in the back. Oh, perfect. All right, let's That's go. That's awesome. What, uh, what was that? You don't want to know. That looks really good. Can you make those two borders those like the two, same yeah. size? They'll be. Do you want the 400 on both sides? Yeah, make it like evenly spaced. And can you just make that right there? Can you make that balloon bold? That's my favorite font. Yeah. It's so hot. All right, so the app will be live in, give me an hour. Perfect. Thank you so much. I love you. Or I like, th thank you. You're welcome. Chester! Ow! Oh. Oh, Alex! Ow. Oh, that hurts so bad. Oh, bet you slipped your L5 and your L6 out. I'm also a chiropractor. I'll crack you out, make you feel good. Are you serious? Yeah. Wow. Anyway, listen, I need some sausage. No mash. Unless, wait, mash is, that's drugs, right? Yeah, yeah, mash is drugs. Yeah, okay, yeah, I don't, just the sausage, please. All right, proud of you. All right, follow me. Be careful, though. Walk with your left foot first. Yeah. You want to keep running? No, 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 please. Okay. Oh! Ooh. Yeah? Oh, nice. Yeah. Thank you. Told you. Drink plenty of water. Alex, meet Yana. Chester, I already met this player. By the way, you still owe me a ton of money. Now get off my property, baby dick. I got a nice dick. 
So, you have any of those lace panties with the PP hole cut out of them? With the PP? Oh, oh, crotch. Yeah, we call them crotchless panties. Yeah, I got some dangly bits down there. Dangly, dangly bits? Mm -hmm. What is that? I've got an extra large labia, dude. Oh. Yeah. Ew. Oh yeah, I can look into that item for you, for sure. Uh, so, Jana, I have a, a business proposition for you. Oh, intriguing. Well, let's step into my office where it's a bit warmer. Okay. So Alex is pretty upset, huh? Upset? He practically died right here on the floor. <laughs> is he okay? After his condition fit, he popped up and flew out of here like Trump at an MLK parade. That's whack, bro. Way whack. So I've been thinking, uh, you should really hook me up. I mean, come on, there's gotta be some chicks out there that want that dev dick, yeah? Dev, buddy. Nobody wants to bang a dude that still lives with his parents and sleeps on rubber sheets. It's the noises. What's that? Oh, that's just some GHB that Chester left here. GHB? Yeah. Get hoes banging. <laughs> Ma'am, can I help you over there? Okay. What do you, Deb? Oh. <laughs> You're about to be trash. Tastes like Skittles to me. You, Gavin? Ah, Steph Curry. Swish. That's from Falker. He wants his money. Eight, hey, wake up, wake up. 8 p.m. Friday. Otherwise, next time, I'm not gonna be so nice. Aww. Oh. Huh. After you, ma'am. No, thank you. Oh, you have a proposition for me. I do, yeah. So uh, I think I might have a, a use for your expertise mm. that might uh, financially benefit the both of us. Hmm, money makes my dangling bits tingle. Mm. Tell me more. C can you please stop saying dangly bits? No, they make most of my financial decisions. Oh, okay. Um, go on. All right, uh, moving on. Uh, ma'am, that's really not necessary. Stay with me, son. He's still breathing. Where should we dump him? <sighs> so I went to my friend who invented this app, which is Amazing. I think it's the perfect way to combine my product at my store with your, you know, skills. That's my number one seller there. Oh, congrats. He's in training. Oh. I wish you plenty of, of sex. Yes, so let me get this straight. It's underwear and escorts. Precisely, yeah. So let me show you how it works. So first the customer selects their garments right here, right? Then for a slight upcharge, they can select the special delivery option. Hmm? That's when you, you have sex with them. Can't we just leave him here? Nah, just a little further. Trust me, there's a pond about 20 feet around the corner. He'll think we went down there and got drunk and fed the ducks again. You do that? Yeah, when the bread gets stale at his dad's grocery store, we go down there and get straight wasted and feed it to the ducks. They love it, they eat it right up. Quack, quack. <laughs> he caught it. He caught it. <laughs> Gavin. Whoa. You're not supposed to feed ducks bread, man. What are you doing here, man? You just like hang out here? Looks like he got into my GHB. Nah, well, yeah. Well, then one of Falker's friends came down and beat him like a straight drum set. It was rowdy. <laughs> Come on, give me a hand. <sighs> I 
Wait a minute. Forgot to lock the store. Handle this. You got this. Get back here, young man. That's all your legs. You got it. It's all in your legs. Good job, Wade. Oh, shut up. And I have a name. It's Bertha. All right, Bertha. Oh, look at this kid's underwear. I gotta start getting my garters online. Buying retail is such a pain in the ass nowadays. <sighs> hey. Now you owe me $25. Cool. Well, you're not alone, buddy. You're all right. Look, I can explain. I was got to take this. What's this? We're uh, embracing technology. Right on. It's like that coffee shop app. Painting straight to your door kind of thing, huh? Yeah, yeah, kind of. But a bit of a twist. Easy to use. It's like quantities, shopping cart, special delivery option. $400? I mean, I know shipping's gotten expensive these days, but what kind of package we selling? Oh. I see that package. Meow. <laughs> Namie, good job. Thank you. Look, can we get a minute, please? Sure, I gotta head anyways. I gotta go find my brother. So oh. I'll see you later, Alex. All right, later, Namie. Hey, thanks for today. Seriously, I owe you big time. Anytime. It's Jana, by the way. But some people call me Yana. OK. Look, I don't know about this, bro. I mean, I love the creativity, but isn't this illegal? Illegal? Dude, you borrowed money from a drug dealer, then lied to me about it. So let's not talk about morals. Well, is there even a market for this type of thing with chicks? Because they can get their kitty cat tapped anytime they want. Well, we'll never know unless we try, right? Plus, if it doesn't work, we're gonna have to close the store anyway. So why don't we just give this a shot? Well, I guess you're right. Oh, by the way, you left the door unlocked again. Where were you? Uh, hush, little baby, don't you dare. If you're good, we'll sniff some underwear. Mm Lost another. I hope this plan works, bro. You got a pretty good feeling about it. Nice. I like the positive attitude coming back. Give me the old college try. <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah. <laughs> <coughs> All right, dumbass, you can close up shop. I'm getting out of here. There's just one thing I don't get. What's that? 
Why did Jana agree to do this in the first place? I mean, wouldn't we be cutting into her business? I think she just saw the great opportunity to expand her clientele. Plus, I told her you do her deliveries for a week. But strictly her, because she uh, thinks you're cute. Good luck. familiar to me. Didn't you go to high school with my grandma? Yes, I did. Keep talking dirty to me. Oh, you little vixen. <laughs> <laughs> 